shoot you. Spika looking for a chance to maybe get involved Where here. And Johnson steps forward. That's the sign for Spika to press the go button. Flash coming out from Johnson there, keeping himself alive. But now Aframu wants to go for some CC onto Treats. Black Shield going to prevent that from happening. And Dardock shows up just to make sure you're four here. Ah, get the camera. I'm up to CS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The camera's staying in the closet. Nobody's nobody's worried about it right now. <laughs> but there's your Wombo combo with oh! the CC. One more headshot would have been able to kill Aframu. The inventory no. going for the Rod of Ages early on. Wants to be tankier here on the Twisted Fate. Viper bunks his head into the wall. Doesn't go exactly where he wants to be. And with the Hextech ultimatum coming down, down. First Blood is issued! Uh, as well as the Abyssal, which I assume he still would go towards. Uh, but they're looking for a four-man play down here on this bottom side. TP coming in for Viper. Double lift's probably dead. Nice arrow on the double lift. He has the Black Shield to be able to deny the second part of the Orn Horn, but Treats can't say the same. He will be the sacrificial lamb, but what did he actually sacrifice for? A whole lot of nothing, it looks like, because Johnson picks up the kill. Anyway, and over on the side of Dinktoss, let's watch this play one more time. I think they played it out fairly well. You know, ideally, Treats actually would have Black Shielded the arrow, of course, um, but that is fairly difficult to actually react to. You know, the Black Shield was there for the Ord Ulti, but they did end up going down. Here's the play one more time. Looking for Phoenix. All right. We're talking about Broken Blade making the plays. Hextech Ultimatum onto Phoenix, who gets away. Second drink of the game over to Dignitas. So now this third one spawning in three minutes isn't exactly going to be a soul stack for anybody, but Bjergsen's in some trouble. Flashing away, stays alive for now. More damage coming out from Johnson. Well, having some incredible sidesteps and, and very good play overall, but you just can't win in the same way. Broken Blade, though, going oh. for the all-in. It is Flash and Flash, both committed by these top laners. Viper with some nice CC. Viper oh! with the solo kill. Give him the ball. And Broken Blade again going for it, but this time it is the 2v1. Not a fair fight. This time they got back up. Broken Blade has learned the lessons of so the previous he. engagement. Potentially win. You win this team fight, you put yourself at soul point, all of a sudden the goalie doesn't really matter that much. So they are starting it and they are just rushing it. Can TSM stop okay. this whatsoever? Speak up. I think he's not going to be there in time. Arrow fired off at Bjergsen to keep him away and Dignitas are on soul point. Vipers in the front line, tanking everything up. He is CC'd for about a year and a half. It's just about over. There we go. Now he's walking away, but Phoenix nearly killed off as well. Viper going back to block that shot. TSM still looking to chase further forward. Dignitas firing off that Orn Horn. Will not get the CC because it oh, is they're trying to wrap around by Spika. TSM still does not want to let Dig out of this one. What is the call here from Dignitas? Spika barely alive still. Dardock on the front line. Damage coming through. Dardock is still alive. Broken Blade trying to jump in. Now Double is grabbing the kill onto Johnson. And with the AD carry gone, Dignitas' chances of winning this fight must just be evaporated. Double if takes about one third of his Jerkson's eight. gonna ult back from, from the base. Battlestar. They're just trying to keep him here forever. They're waiting for Bjergsen yeah, to base and come back. Oh, this, this is hilarious. Is, this is cruel and unusual punishment. They're just making him sit there and wait until it's fish in a barrel. Oh no, they're all just standing there waiting for their impending doom. Dardock is stuck in the Drake pit. He hops over the wall. Bjergsen's rejoined the fight. Doublelift grabbing himself a kill there. Broken play getting one on to Aframu. Viper now going to be cut down. Doublelift looking to make even more happen. Bjergsen grabbing a kill too. It is an ace for TSM. Ultimately, because the team fighting is really strong on Dignitas, if they just YOLO'd in there, they would have died for sure. They had to play that out very Population uh, Dignitas. Population you, brother. <laughs> as TSM are closing in on his base. Look at the damage on to Dardoch. Everything, and it looks like TSM may just close the game here because this is the third hit they're going to go for. Dignitas looks like they want to fight, but that's just Spika. Oh, and there is no ulti for Dardoch. Recall that that had already been used just moments ago. Bjergsen with a nice stasis, keeping himself safe from the counterattack, showing up from Dig. And with two dead on the side of Dignitas, surely enough, this is the end of the series and the end of the line for Dignitas as TSM will put in work on the Nexus turrets. They're gone before I even finish my sentence. TSM will make swift work of Dignitas with a 3-0 victory and will move on to the next round of playoffs.